guys, I'm going to do my normal upload because you'll probably notice something's a bit off already. Um, so what happened was on Monday I had a game to upload. It wasn't actually this one, I've just got a shorter one for uh, this game. Uh, but I went to plug my microphone in because all I needed to do was do the voice recording. And after I'd done that, I was going to be able to upload to YouTube. The thing is, when I started, when I put my microphone in, it wasn't showing up as one of the options for voice recording. And it's just not, the computer's just not registering it, so it's obviously broken. And I'm going to have to order a new one. So what I'm doing right now is I'm actually recording my voice through a webcam and as you'll notice the sound quality is definitely not the best. Now my new microphone should be arriving about when, well tomorrow Wednesday if Amazon are to be to believe be so it's not going to be too long it's just I'm not going to be uploading my normal games. I'll try and probably get an upload tomorrow sometime but that'll still be with a webcam if I have time in the morning so that's going to be very dependent. Um, but I will definitely be prioritising getting the troll game released on Friday because um, if I get the webcam tomorrow I won't be able to do any recording on the night because I'm busy all tomorrow um, so yeah Thursday will be the, the next time I have a chance to record um, so I will, I will be getting the troll game out on Friday as normal but until then uh, things are going to be a bit uh, off anyway um, in this game, this was a 4v4 match, um, as you can see, a Nose is playing pink and is above me. And it was random positions, so we're all scattered around. You can see there's a te an enemy team to the right of us, there's an enemy team to the top right, and there's Salty Gerben coming from the uh, in yellow to attack Nose's base. So what I'm doing, because I've already scouted uh, the base to the right of me, and it seems like it's quite a new place, so I'm taking a bit of a risk now, and I'm going to go to Nose's base, to provide a bit of support. And you see that Purple, our teammate, is out of the game already. Um, so he's been defeated. And uh, you can see Yellow's uh, coming down now, but he hasn't got many tanks left. And you can see Pink Nose coming out with the light tanks. And Nose is in a real good position here because he's next to the gems. So he's going to have plenty of ore in order to make those light tanks. And I'm just having a look. And you can see he's in green, green space at the moment. And, yeah, I'm just having a look around here, because Green seems to have some tanks of his own. And I'm just, uh, obviously, trying to keep in Nose's base, but I'm also aware of that person to the right of me, and just fingers crossed that they won't attack me. And you can see Nose is going for that ore refinery, and it looks like he's going to get it down. But he has lost a lot of tanks there and you'll have to uh, be able to survive the counter. You can see Salty Gerben coming from the top in plain as a yellow. And I'm building plenty of medium tanks. I'm just keeping an eye on that person who's now built a Tesla coil. He does have some tanks in his base, so the best uh, thing for him to do would be to attack me, but he hasn't decided to do that. And, he can, and Salty Gerben is going for the ore refinery, but we've got too many tanks here. He might get one down, but he won't get the other one down, but uh, we might be able to, they might both survive. Or maybe not. I think he will get that down. Yes, it goes down, but he's definitely not going to get another one down or do any further damage. And you can see he's lost a lot of tanks there. And now it's probably time for us to counter. I'm going to get a radar dome down so I can see what's happening and make sure that guy in the bottom right doesn't attack me. And you can see that it looks like um, Green is out of it. And you can see Nose pushing up with the light tanks. Um, Salty Gerben is there with the medium tanks at the bottom. And it looks like we're going to push through because now it's going to be effectively two against one. I just have to hope the guy in the bottom right doesn't attack me and everything's going to be fine. So now we can see that uh, Salty Gerben is having to pull back to his base. He's got massive light tanks going in there. We'll see what he's got to defend with. But I think he'll have just been focusing on tanks because he's just been attacking. And yeah, you can see our forces are too big um, and he's having to fall back. All I know is he's losing some tanks, but um, it's not going to be enough. And you can see Orange uh, coming into the base also um, to help uh, defend. But he hasn't got that many tanks, um, so he's not gonna, it's not going to be that good at the moment. And you can see that uh, Yellow is being... His base is basically going to be uh, gone. Although he has still got quite a good number of light tanks, but uh, we've just got too many, and we've taken out his main buildings. I think his construction yard is gone, and now his last war factory is going to go, and there's going to be no way for him to build any more tanks. 
Um, all you can see is that uh, numbers are still alright for the time being. And um, we're just focusing on uh, destroying his base before the person in the bottom right decides to attack. But you can see the green are trying to make a little counter on Nose. Uh, but it's already three tanks. Nose has got four tanks. And I think he's got... Has he got other raw refineries? He may do. Yeah, well he does now. We can see him just uh, putting one up. And you can see... Uh, that's the last of Green's uh, tanks. Once they're uh, gone, he's got no more, so it's going to be no more surprise attacks. You can see he's got the odd infantry guy. Um, and we can see Yellow coming out of his base now, but as we saw, he won't, after this, he won't be able to build any more tanks. So it's going to be quite, uh, I think it's going to be quite easy to defend, because all we have to do is defend that gap. And it's always hard to push through a gap, you need to have a lot more tanks. And he just won't have the numbers, I don't think, here. You can see a lot of those tanks are damaged. And our tanks are full HP because they've just been made from the war factory. And um, the other one, they've been, obviously, in a fight while he was defending his base. And you can see his tank num numbers starting to be whittled down. And he's not going to be able to uh, maintain that uh, push. Uh, you can see his tank numbers are very, very low now. And I'm just going to build some pillboxes just in case I do get attacked. Although it looks uh, very unlikely at the moment. Because um, uh, Cyan has been playing quite a, quite a quiet game, let's say. And now I'm going to go back down to the bottom of the map uh, to fight Cyan. Um, and we'll see what he's got now. Because he has been uh, building up for the whole game. And we'll see how strong um, his base defence is going to be. And we did see him build some Tesla coils earlier, so you might have a Tesla wall or something. And we can see that Pink is at the top nose, and it looked like Cyan had some Tesla tanks there. Uh, but we're going in for the attack now, and you can see he's got the power plants right at the front of his base, so if we take out the power, that'll probably take out his Tesla coil. So that was a little bit of a mistake from Cyan um, about where he built things within his base. And you can see it hasn't, he hasn't got too much here. And we've just been able to take out all his buildings. Swarm his medium tanks. And you can see how compact his base is. Uh, usually what you want to do is you want to spread out. Because you want those or, or refineries to be close to the ore patches. Um, he's also got a radar dome. And uh, he's got a service depot. Which, I mean, service depot allows you to build multiple MCVs. But he hasn't gone for the second MCV. And that's him out of the game. And now we can see red... Um, is red RT? Yeah, red's just going off to finish orange. Um, who looks like he's only got... He's, he, I think he's got a, possibly a sneaky MCV out there. But he's selling up, and that's the end of the game. So yeah, hopefully I will get my new microphone tomorrow. I might get another video up off if I'm able to record in the morning, but that's going to depend on some things. Anyway, thank you.